The fuel valve, known as fuel injector, is fitted on the cylinder cover by two holding down bolts. The fuel valves atomize the high pressure fuel supplied by the fuel pump and injects into the cylinder. In this fuel valve, fuel oil is circulated when engine is standby. When the engine is started, the circulation of oil will stop and the pressurized oil is supplied to the cylinder. The fuel valve consists of a valve body, valve head, and union nut. The non-return valve, thrust spindle with thrust spring and spindle guides are assembled inside the valve body. The spindle guide complete consists of spindle guide, nozzle, thrust piece, and cutoff shaft. The spindle guide is assembled with a press fit. Cutoff shaft is pressed against the tapered valve seat of spindle guide by the action of the thrust spring. The spring pressure is transmitted through the slotted thrust foot. The thrust spring determines the opening pressure of the valve. The non-return valve consists of housing, thrust piece, slide, and spring. The non-return valve is assembled with a press fit. The slide of the non-return valve is pressed by the spring against the tapered valve seat inside the non-return valve. In this position, the head of the slide uncovers a small bore arranged for circulation purposes in the thrust piece. 